Please describe your job title and primary duties. Uh, I started out as a tire tech and I ended up as a crew chief. And uh, basically we ran what was called cells and then the garage was divided into cells and each cell took care of two cars and there were four man teams. And the positions were kind of hierarchical. You had your two tire techs, a crew chief, and then um, what was the top guy called? Crew chief and then service coordinator was the top guy in your cell. And we changed tires all day long, as fast as you can imagine. No brakes, no slowdowns, busy all day, hard work. And uh, I worked in College Station doing that for a little while. And we were one of the busiest stores in North America. So it was really, really busy. Never break. What was your favorite part about working there? Uh, yeah, I did. You know, I, I liked I like work like that. I like manual labor. You look at the rest of my job experience. It's kind of what I like to do. Or, or even when it's not that, it's waiting tables, so it's still busy. So the good part about it is, is you're not going to be bored <laughs> at all. <laughs> so you're not watching the clock. Please describe the application and interview process. Uh, yeah, the application process is pretty standard. You can go in. Uh, I would do it in person. I think you can do it online, but they prefer to see people. They're still kind of old school. It's more traditional company. So I'd go in, get your application, fill it out, and just go back and bug them, drop it off, check if they want to talk to you, come back the next day, see if they want to talk to you again, and just keep coming back until eventually they'll they'll give you an interview. And once they do, they pretty much put you to work right away. And uh, we have standard drug tests. You go, they give you like 24 hours to go to a lab, get your drug test done, come back, and... That's that, and then they put you to work, and they give you a t-shirt before they give you a monogrammed uniform shirt because a lot of kids don't make the cut the first couple of weeks. What questions did the interviewer ask during the job interview? Uh, just talking about job experience, just to see if you've been able to handle yourself. Um, you know, they don't discriminate against size, but if you're a smaller guy, they're definitely going to be more reluctant to hire you because pretty much everyone there is larger just a lot of the weight the machine i mean it's all day it's lifting you it's work how were you notified that you received the job i got hired on the spot so i did my interview and the manager was like i like you you're in so uh, by the time i dropped my application started working there it was probably no more than four or five days what other advice would you give to a job seeker looking to gain employment uh, if you're going to go try to become employed at Discount Tire, I would be in it for the long run because the true benefits of working at Discount Tire don't show up for the long run. But once they do, they're really good. It's Like I said, it's a conservative Christian company, and uh, they have really good benefits for their employees. They're full-time employees, not just your regular garage employees like me. But you can work your way up to being running a cell if you don't like dealing with people or eventually go to sales out in the front. And I know guys there that make $14, $15 an hour and, you know, that's just because they've been there for years, and then once you get full time, uh, you get all those benefits for like six, seven dollars a week. You can have full healthcare coverage and dental for your family. I mean, it's ridiculously cheap. So, uh, and then the general managers can make a quarter million. So, it's a good long run job if if you don't have a college degree and you don't want to get into the corporate world or anything like that.